All right, we're back on this old Acura that has the used condenser that was leaking and I replaced the O-rings and I did a quick vacuum and I wanted to show you a moisture thing. Okay, so I was able to bring it down and I got it down here to like 500 microns. Then I turned it off and you could see it jumped up here to 3200 microns, then it stables out because think of air like water in a fish tank and if you push the fish tank, the water goes up and down on both sides. It keeps splashing back and forth before it finally gets to its level point and then you know how high the water is. If you push the water, it goes up high over here but it's low over here until it settles off. Well, air, molecules of air do the same thing. When you turn it off, there's a stabilization point where the pressure is higher over here far away from the point of vacuum and it's lower over here and it has to stable out and that's what's happening right here but what you're seeing is it's starting to stable out it's up here at a 2600 microns because there's so much moisture in the system because this was a used old condenser with a completely moisture saturated desiccant material and all the oil and i told you that in the previous video when i started to vacuum this it had a really foul oil smell like foul um olive oil or uh, what's that other oil uh, you know any salad dressing oil or something like that and that's from the oil breaking down and going rancid nothing I can do about that uh, so I'm gonna go away have lunch go to another job leave this longer on the vacuum pump um, already took care of the leaks by replacing the o-rings and we will come back and see where this thing goes. Here, I'm turning it on right now, and you're gonna see this jump down. I had to turn the screen brightness down because my battery's gonna be going dead pretty soon, and I wanted to see if I could catch this before when I come back from eating something, and uh, just show you kind of a before and after and see what it looks like. All right, guys, I will see you later, and uh, we'll see how this thing goes. We'll do the best with what we got. See ya.